The global automotive industry is on the cusp of a revolution. The age of the internal combustion engine, which has powered our vehicles for over a century, is gradually giving way to a new era. This new era is defined by electric vehicles, or EVs, which promise to transform not just the way we drive, but also the way we think about energy and the environment. The internal combustion engine, a mainstay for over a century, is facing a formidable challenger, the electric vehicle. Unlike their gasoline-powered predecessors, electric vehicles produce zero emissions, making them a crucial part of the fight against climate change. They are quieter, more efficient, and increasingly affordable as technology advances. This shift represents not just a technological evolution, but a reshaping of geopolitics, with China and the United States vying for dominance in this burgeoning market. The stakes are high. Control over the EV market means not just economic prosperity, but also a significant influence on global energy policies and environmental strategies. Dominance in the EV sector means not just economic prosperity, but also control over a crucial industry of the future. It is about setting standards, driving innovation, and leading the world towards a more sustainable future. The countries that lead in EV technology will also lead in the broader transition to renewable energy. It signifies technological leadership, job creation, and a say in how the world combats climate change. The transition to electric vehicles is expected to create millions of new jobs in manufacturing, research, and infrastructure development. It is a chance to build a greener, more sustainable economy. This is not just about cars, it's about the future of mobility. Autonomous electric vehicles, urban electric buses, and futuristic mobility concepts are all part of this new landscape. The way we move people and goods is set to change dramatically, with electric power at the heart of this transformation. And in this race, China has taken an early and commanding lead. With significant investments in EV technology and infrastructure, China is positioning itself as the global leader in electric mobility. Chinese brands are becoming household names, and their innovation centers are at the forefront of this revolution. But the United States, with its history of innovation and entrepreneurial spirit, is not one to be easily outdone. American tech startups and established automakers alike are pouring resources into EV development. Silicon Valley, the heart of technological innovation, is buzzing with new ideas and breakthroughs in electric mobility. The question is, can it overcome its challenges and catch up to the Asian giant? The race is on and the outcome will shape the future of transportation, energy, and the global economy. The electric future is not just a possibility, it is here, and it is transforming our world. China's emergence as a global leader in electric vehicles has been nothing short of remarkable. From being a relatively minor player a decade ago, China now commands a dominant share of the global EV market. The numbers tell a compelling story. China is the world's largest manufacturer and consumer of electric vehicles, accounting for over half of global sales. Its cities boast more electric cars than any other nation, and its charging infrastructure is sprawling and sophisticated. This meteoric rise is not a coincidence. It is the result of a deliberate multi-pronged strategy by the Chinese government and industry aimed at capturing the lion's share of this transformative market. Central to China's success is a potent combination of proactive government policies and a vast receptive domestic market. Recognizing the strategic importance of the EV sector early on, the Chinese government implemented a range of policies designed to stimulate EV adoption and support its domestic industry. Subsidies, tax breaks, and incentives for both consumers and manufacturers made electric vehicles more affordable and attractive. Simultaneously, the government invested heavily in research and development, fostering innovation and technological advancements in battery technology, charging infrastructure and EV manufacturing. This robust support, coupled with China's massive population and rapidly growing middle class, created a perfect storm for EV adoption. The result is a thriving ecosystem of EV manufacturers, battery producers, and charging infrastructure providers, all feeding off each other's growth. While China has been racing ahead, the United States, a traditional automotive powerhouse, has been playing catch-up. Though the U.S. has made strides in recent years, its efforts pale in comparison to the sheer scale and speed of China's EV push. The reasons for this lag are multifaceted. While the U.S. government has introduced some policies to encourage EV adoption, these have been less consistent and comprehensive compared to China's aggressive approach. 
Moreover, the U.S. faces challenges in scaling up its domestic EV manufacturing capacity and building a robust supply chain for critical components like batteries. These factors, combined with a less developed charging infrastructure, have hampered the pace of EV adoption in the United States. Section 5. The Supply Chain Struggle. A Tale of Two Countries. A key factor underpinning China's EV dominance is its control over the supply chain. You see, China has strategically positioned itself as the world's leading supplier of raw materials critical for EV batteries, such as lithium, cobalt, and nickel. This control over the supply chain gives China a significant advantage, allowing it to control costs, ensure a steady supply of components, and potentially even influence global EV production. The United States, on the other hand, is heavily reliant on imports for these crucial materials, exposing it to potential supply chain disruptions and price volatility. This dependence on foreign suppliers poses a significant challenge to the U.S.'s ambition of becoming a global EV leader. Section 6. Batteries Included, The Power Struggle Shaping the EV Race At the heart of the EV revolution lies the battery. These powerhouses are not just the lifeblood of electric vehicles but also the focal point of a global technological race. Batteries are the most expensive and technologically complex component of an electric vehicle, requiring advanced materials and intricate manufacturing processes. Their performance and cost are crucial determinants of an EV's range, affordability, and overall appeal. The better the battery, the more attractive the vehicle. China has made significant strides in battery technology and manufacturing. Over the past decade, it has invested heavily in research and development. It is home to some of the world's largest battery manufacturers such as Cattell and BYD, which dominate the global market. Chinese companies are at the forefront of battery innovation, pushing the boundaries of what's possible in energy storage, particularly in the development of lithium iron phosphate or LFP batteries, which offer a cheaper and more stable alternative to traditional lithium ion batteries. LFP batteries are less prone to overheating and have a longer lifespan, making them an attractive option for many manufacturers. The United States, while having strong research capabilities in battery technology, faces challenges in scaling up production. It lags behind in terms of large-scale battery production and cost competitiveness, which are critical for mass adoption of EVs. This gap in battery technology and manufacturing poses a significant hurdle for the U.S. in its quest to compete with China in the EV arena. Bridging this gap will require substantial investment and innovation. Section 7. Infrastructure and Innovation. Paving the way for an electric future. Beyond batteries, the widespread adoption of electric vehicles hinges on the availability of a robust charging infrastructure. China has made significant investments in building a vast network of public charging stations, making it convenient for EV owners to charge their vehicles. This comprehensive charging infrastructure has been instrumental in alleviating range anxiety, a major barrier to EV adoption in many parts of the world. The United States, while making progress in expanding its charging network, still has a long way to go to match the scale and density of China's infrastructure. Addressing this infrastructure gap is crucial for accelerating EV adoption and catching up to China's lead. Section 8. The Road Ahead, Predicting the Future of the EV Showdown Looking ahead, the competition between China and the United States in the EV market is only going to intensify. Both nations are investing heavily in research and development, aiming to outpace each other in this rapidly growing industry. The stakes are high, and the race is on to see who will dominate the future of electric mobility. China, with its early lead government support and control over the supply chain, is well positioned to maintain its dominance in the near future. The Chinese government has implemented policies that favor the growth of the EV sector, including subsidies and incentives for both manufacturers and consumers. This strategic approach has given China a significant advantage. However, the EV market is still evolving and the long-term outcome of this rivalry is far from certain. Market dynamics can shift rapidly, influenced by technological advancements, consumer preferences, and global economic conditions. The landscape of the EV industry could look very different in a few years. The United States, with its innovative capacity and entrepreneurial spirit, still has the potential to close the gap if it can address its challenges effectively. American companies are known for their ability to innovate and disrupt markets.
If they can overcome hurdles such as supply chain issues and regulatory barriers, they could become formidable competitors in the global EV market. The future will likely be shaped by factors such as technological breakthroughs in battery technology, which could significantly enhance the performance and affordability of electric vehicles. Innovations in battery storage and efficiency are crucial for the next generation of EVs. The pace of charging infrastructure development, which is essential for widespread EV adoption, the availability and accessibility of charging stations will play a critical role in consumer acceptance and convenience, and the policies adopted by both countries to support their respective EV industries. Government regulations, incentives, and international collaborations will all influence the trajectory of the EV market. The interplay of these elements will determine who leads the charge in the electric vehicle revolution. Section 9. The Final Lap – A Call to Action The transition to electric vehicles is a defining moment in the global automotive industry and a critical front in the U.S.-China rivalry. It is a race that will have profound implications for the global economy, the environment, and the balance of power in the 21st century. While China currently has the upper hand, the United States still has a chance to compete if it acts decisively and strategically. The outcome of this competition will depend on the choices made by both countries in the coming years. What are your thoughts on the future of the EV showdown? Share your insights and join the conversation in the comments below.